National player Anisia Batiste is confident the Calypso girls will have a good showing at the Netball World Cup in Liverpool, England. The national netball team played a practice game against the national men's team on Friday at the Jean Pierre Sports Complex. Ian Wiesan has more. The Calypso girls enjoyed a good workout against the men's national team. Shaquanda Green with the interception as she was trailing back in defence. Now UK-based Khalifa McCollin scored 30 goals as she led from in front. Now on the men's side, Dextro Manswell was the big man. His imposing presence gave the Calypso girls some problems. A little bit again and I thought he was going to slam dunk this one. But he scored 20 goals from 22 attempts. Jamile McCarthy came on in the second half and contributed 12 goals. Now there was a scare in the fourth quarter. When Khalifa McCollin went down, she rolled over her ankle and left the game with some help. Tahira Hollingsworth returned to the game and scored six goals, shooting 66%. After the game, defensive player Anissia Batiste explained the team's readiness. Out of 100%, I would say that our team is, and I'll be as honest, I would say 90%. We're really banking on those warm-up matches that we're going to get um, in Wales, against Wales and uh, against Malawi. We're really banking on those matches to have that peak in our game in preparation for the tournament. So everything in its time. The Calypso girls will leave on Tuesday en route to the UK where they will play a series of warm-up matches before the tournament starts. Ian Wason, TTT Sports. A serious push is on to improve both the numbers and image of men's netball here in TNT. And on Sunday, the Federation will host a tournament to do just that. It is based on men and women. Five men, two women per team. The women will be playing at wing attack and wing defense. And the men play center court, goal defense, goalkeeper, goal attack and goal shooter. The idea of adding women to the men's teams is just a continuation of a concept devised many years ago and which is finally taking root in leagues across TNT, including the popular All Sectors Netball League. That is a MEFNA thing and it is spreading now. Port of Spain Division has it, San Fernando League has it, as well as All Sector. But that is one of Liz, deceased Lestra Lewis and Barbara Chandler Breen Child. So we don't want it to slip from slip away from us so we are trying our best to keep it alive and make sure that men are represented in the sport of netball